All right, this is the side entrance here. You can probably hear her. She's running right now. I'm gonna go in the front. This is the door. Super heavy duty. It's got window coverings. You can slide the windows open. Close them. Snap it up for coverage. This one is, doesn't open, so I just have it blocked off. All right, you go up the stairs. There's a little curtain. You'll have to forgive the boxes of stuff, but it gives you an idea of space in here. So this is a bench that folds out to a Murphy bed. I'll show that in a moment. But just to give an overall view of what it looks like. And then that's the pass through to go to the cab. As you can see, it's a bit of a disaster, but you got some time, energy, and willpower, you can fix that. And then the pass through, I'm 5'3", and I have to duck to go through, and I can squeeze through there, but uh, if you're taller or bigger, that might be an issue. I'll show a better view of the cab in a moment. Uh, so anyways, that's that, and then this is the side. There's the door again that we just came in. So this is a good storage space. The person before me had the uh, the Dometic cooler hooked up to the solar and then hooked in here. And this actually, this rolls in and out of the cabinet. I didn't like it set up like that. And then like this comes down. So I don't know if I can do it one handed, but um, See how that comes down? So you can roll this up and down. I just like to keep it up. Um, there's just junk in there right now, so ignore all that. Um, so then you have the light switches here. Uh, these are the dome lights. Here, I'll do the dome lights. And that's the other one. You can do them light, and you can do them like that, or you can do them like that. So there's two settings for all the lights. I like to keep them bright when I'm, oops, that was the fan. Uh, so you can see everything. Uh, this is one of the cabinets. Again, random stuff in there, please ignore that. But they, this is the originals that were part of the ambulance. It just um, slides in their storage space back there. All right. And then there's the sink that's not hooked up, but it has the faucet. I never bothered with it. The stove, it works. It's hooked up into a propane tank on the outside um, in one of the um, side units, side cabinets of the ambulance. It all works. Then the second set of cabinets, and these have the uh, rolly things. You can roll out your, and you store stuff in it and roll them out. And the bottom one has both of those. And then there's another cabinet here which you can use to hang stuff if you want. I used it, I put in one of these uh, storage things in it and that worked really well to store clothing. And this is the uh, antenna to get a signal inside the box here because otherwise there's too much metal, you can't get a signal. So this, uh, you turn it on and then that, um, it's actually not hooked up at the moment, but it will be and have to put the antenna back in. Um, and then, just so you can see, these are the back windows. I have these here for, um, 
just to block. But these, uh, these should open. They might be a little stuck, but they will. You can open those. Um, this back door is a little tricky. Here, you can put the coverings back over it. They just uh, snap on. They were specially made for the ambulance. Uh, this is the back door. This opens up to the rear. It's very tricky to open. Sometimes it works and sometimes it doesn't. So that's something you might have to futz with. Um, and so then there's uh, storage here. This is in the bench. Uh, nice storage area. Uh, drawers that come out. Again, more storage. And here. Yeah, let's see if I can do it. <clears throat> more storage in here. And even more storage in here. So those are all uh, part of the bench there. So the way the uh, Murphy bed works, here I'll do a pan out a little bit so you can see. This comes down, so you unhook it. So that's what holds it in place while you're driving. And there's three of them. And then I'm gonna try to fold it down and not drop the phone. And then you have a bed. It doesn't have a mattress on it or anything, but it fits a twin pretty nicely. And then when you're ready to drive, you fold it up. Clasp it back in place. Yep. And that's it. See? It folds up and folds down. Um, the floors, as you can see, are vinyl. Some rugs here. There's storage underneath here. It's not fancy or anything, but uh, you can store stuff under there. Um, and then here and this cabinet is where you have your solar and everything. You can plug in plug-ins there and that's about it for the inside oh that curtain fell down <clears throat>